Hello everybody, Deadpool3416 here, talking about another time fall, no, time returns, uh, Transformers figure. Now as you guys can see, it's a new one, it's a Wolf Wire and Monux, Monoxo, or Monxo, whatever, what to say Monoxo. So we got this guy right here, he looks pretty damn cool, different weapon though with a sword, that's pretty damn dope. So I'm actually pretty happy I found him. But I'm at Walmart, going to go get a few things, and I just said, you know, I might as well. They have, they have the $10 ones, and they did. They have him, so I was pretty damn excited. And uh, I'm going to get more of the packaging, guys, because I do like these backgrounds a lot. I like how they did that, and it looks pretty damn cool. I'm not going to lie. Those are the lips? That's weird. Uh, so this is the packaging, how it looks like. Um, we look at the other side. Um, yeah, there's the head. Sky read. Sky read head. And you have... Mind Whip, which we have, I think this is a Ast Astro Train, Astro Train, do we have Astro Train? We don't know, I don't know, do I have Astro Train? Uh, you know, I'll look later, uh, then we have Soundwave, which I saw at Walmart, but he was over my price, I really wanted him to be honest with you, he looks pretty damn dope, but hopefully in holidays, you never know, um, this is the Transformer Transition, so I'm guessing a Tiger or Cougar or whatever, uh, there's the head. Apparently, you put the head inside. The thing. That's pretty cool, though. You could take the head, switch in that, put it into that. So that's pretty damn cool. All right, guys. So let's open this guy up and see how okay, he here looks. Here he is ah. out of the packaging. Wolf wire. Uh, looking pretty damn cool figure. I'm not gonna lie. I really enjoy this figure a lot. I was playing with this figure and actually not that long ago because uh. I had to do some other things real quick, but then when I took him out of the packaging, uh, he was a pretty damn good figure. Um, I mean, there's nothing wrong with him, really. I just feel like, I mean, his sword is pretty damn cool. When I looked at this, I'm like, you know, like, I thought it was just going to be like a sucky ass, like, this was a silver, no, light silver? No, it's not silver. What is that? I don't know what kind of material that is or color that is. Um, but the blaster looks pretty damn cool. It's pretty cool. And then his transformer, I did transform it and then transform it back because, you know, I don't want to do the whole like process of like trans on transforming it, but yeah, this is a pretty damn good figure. Um, I think it's not one of my favorites of my Decepticon, but you know what? It's like it's like uh, if they made another Decepticon. Damn, sorry, it's on my finger. That was weird. If they made like another one. Maybe this will be my third. Well, this is my third figure. So my Decepticons of Time Returns. And here, oh, he fell. Don't fade. Don't fall. Don't fall. Well, that's just point the gun. Oh, he's falling. Damn, yeah, well, yeah. Come on, stay. There we go. Oh, look. He's a shit on top. Let's just put this gun down, bro. You don't want to point no one in the eye. Okay. And we, here's this card right here, which is looking pretty damn dope. I do enjoy these cards a lot than more than the figure. No, I'm kidding. Um, it, The design of these look pretty damn cool. I'm not going to lie. If you want to keep these cards, like, let me have them at least. I'll keep them. So, there it is. Damn, his brain is smart, so you're pretty sure he's a smart one. His combat skills are not good. Speed is fast. Strength is like an 8. That's weird, dude. So, this guy's not even that strong. He's just super smart. Okay, so I just see that, that right here that he has his gun right here. Sorry, I'm doing this one hand, guys. So he does have his gun right there, so maybe if I put it right there. Hold on, guys. Uh, how am I going to do this? There we go. So they put the... Oh! Yeah, I like it that way. A lot better. <laughs> yeah, we'll do it like that. So apparently... I guess you're supposed to have it like that. I'm guessing here, guys. I'm not 100% sure, but it does make sense like that, though. I would have it like that, to be honest with you. But yeah, um, maybe I don't know. What do you guys think? All right, guys. So I'm gonna show you guys how this looks in like Transformers collection, how I look. And you guys are probably asking me why this background, because I don't know the lights right here, and yeah, you guys have seen my carpet, but I really don't care because you know it looks awesome that way. Alrighty, alrighty, guys. See you guys in my Transformers collection. Okay, so this is how my Transformer figures are gonna look like now. Um, I'm not gonna be so interested in the movie variants, so. If I do get more than I than I get of these uh brand new ones right here, then I would probably give these away or 
Maybe except for the Dinobots. I do like the Dinobots more than the actual of these guys. If you guys want to trade or buy, I'm willing to do that. So, uh, any of these right here, like, you got Starscream. You got, uh, what's that? Not Soundwave. Um, is that Soundwave? That's not Soundwave. Oh, if it is Soundwave, I doubt Soundwave, but let me know. Uh, we got this guy right here. Optimus Prime and this Bumblebee. So, if you guys want to trade for those, let me know in the comments down below. These are how I set it up for now. It's pretty damn cool. This is my di oh, my Dinobot. That's how I know Chip. I'm gonna watch a lot of Power Rangers. Uh, Autobots. So yeah, I did like this. Like Optimus trying to say roll out. So I know my Transformers guy. I might give him a blaster one. The blasters that they come with. But this is only if I get that Optimus Prime. When I find the Optimus Prime, I will buy it. I will pretty much, well, you never know, guys, you never know, guys the holidays, so, uh, I might put him, if I do get the big Optimus Prime, I actually might put him in the background instead of the front, because this one's smaller and better, and it actually goes size with him, too, so, I mean, you never know, and the sound wave, I'm going to put in the background, of course, I forgot about this Decepticon right here, so I have a total of four Decepticons, which is damn, pretty damn cool, um, I do get the sound wave, I'll put in the background, of course, and, you know, that, that, and that. Might have to get another one, guys. Another one of these right here, the shelves. Put them right here. If not, I might have to like give this whole top row uh Decepticon. I mean Autobots, and this whole row right here Decepticons. And I could just put my movie variants right here. So you never. I mean, I do want to do complete. I do a movie variant, but like a big ass Optimus Prime and the little guys like Bumblebee and all them other ones. So we'll see, guys. We'll see. And uh, that's pretty much my video, guys. Thank you guys for watching this video. I will be doing more Transformer uh, figure reviews. And uh, let me know if you guys like this or not. Uh, give that video a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.